guys, I've made it to the fairgrounds for today's schooling day. I'm just riding Bolshery and Reno in the pen with the better footing. Normally I just ride them on the grass arena at this fair, um, so I'm excited to be able to ride where there's pretty decent footing. Um, and then you'll get to see a few of the other horses that are at the show, and I'm excited to show you the little baby diamond. Also, now I have to go haul in a bunch of stuff and trek across a field to the stables, so I'll meet you there. How's my favorite boy? This is Reno. Are you ready to work? Hey, baby. So I'll put in some pictures of that ride with Reno. Uh, he was absolutely gassed to be out there. Galloping around. Wild man, he's like 23 or 24. Um, unfortunately, my cousin didn't video like I asked because she was a little terrified that um, it was gonna become rowdy and dangerous. It was absolutely rowdy, but it wasn't dangerous, at least for me to be able to ride. Um, absolute blast, mini bucks, <laughs> putting his head down, running around. I mean, he was just absolutely thrilled to be out in an arena with, with nice, like almost clay-like footing, but it was perfect for him without shoes and the size of his feet. Um, and he, I mean, he felt amazing. So that was, it was a great ride. I had a total blast, um, but I am, I'm worn out. I was gripping pretty hard to stay with him because he was just moving. He was rolling around that arena. So I wish she got a video of the absolute speed that he had. Um, we were lapping the little gated pony we were riding with. Uh, so that was hilarious. So yeah, um, that'll be a video compilation and a fun time. And then I'll do some more schooling days for this week since it's not the only one um, and just put it together so that way it's not just a, a one and done type of thing. So, and then we'll be showing um, in a few days. And um, so, yeah, it'll be a good week. So here are some pictures of the first day of schooling him. It was beautiful light in the morning and he was really great. Um, you can see just his muscle when he's cantering to and his neck and his hind quarters. Um, really pretty trot too. He just felt so lovely. Um, it was nice to ride him around in the big space. You can see we're riding in sort of like a sloppy looking bridle. Um, that's what would just ride him in at home. Um, and this, I don't know, it's kind of silicone bridle with no nose band um and this giant loose ring uh the problem with the giant loose ring is i had no brakes and <laughs> not a ton of steering with these nylon reins either uh so we get pictures like that because he looks so fancy but he was really strong you can see all that muscling um but he looks great for his age um being 23 and a draft horse um and throwing in little bucks but they're not Draft horse bucks aren't really all that bad. Um, they can't get too high off the ground um, with their hind ends because they're they are so big. But um, I think it's fun to ride. <laughs> so yeah, um, it was really fun and just a few clips here and there. You can't see the speed, but yeah, still it's good. And then this is part of the second day. Um, this kind of transition, I didn't do very well, but. Um, I'm still happy with how he looked and he was moving really nicely. Um, yeah, so he just looks great. And then a little clip here of just some trotting work. He started to calm down um, and then I finally got him to walk, even though this one chopped off my head. You're eating me. <laughs> I still like this one. See that yeah, picture? Or did they Baby girl, I love the phones, take videos and pics of me. Back home from the second day of schooling and I'm absolutely exhausted. It was very, very humid today. So gross. The weather was terrible. It's dark-ish. Uh, it was pitch black when I left this morning. It's pretty much twilight now, getting home. I rode in the morning and then um, today was halter day, so all the horses just 
walked and trotted up and down and were judged on their confirmation and how they were handled basically so it was a lot of the same thing I don't video it because it's it's like watching a flat class that goes on forever where you're like okay I've seen them walk eight times like it's I'm good um, that's basically halter. So, um, they looked pretty, my family did really well. Um, one of the horses got a grand champion, so that was really cool. And I'll be riding her tomorrow in the trail class and then Reno in a riding class. And I am thrilled to be able to ride him again. Um, since he is older, I'm just grateful for every single ride I get with him. And he's been really feisty both mornings. <laughs> Bucking once again, somehow did like this bucking into a flying lead change this morning. I don't think he's ever been schooled to do changes because he's a draft horse. So it was cool. <laughs> that was exciting and fun. Uh, but yeah, so I'm looking forward to showing tomorrow. And then there's a little fun day show in a couple days. So that'll be, that'll be a good time. Uh, yeah. And so I'm going to shower and head to bed because it's a super early morning tomorrow. <laughs> and that'll be the next video is the actual show day vlog for that. Uh, but this is the end of schooling for the fair. Although I will school tomorrow morning, but I'll just wrap that into the show day. So. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.